Watch you guys got another video here for you on how to bring back the classic start menu on Windows 10. You can see this is the uh, default Windows 10 menu with the tiles here and I'm not a great fan of it and if you really want to bring back the classic style menu then you can do with something like start is back. It's been around for quite a while and someone mentioned it the other day in the comment section and I wanted to make a video just to show you. It's not free but it is only $3.99 but what you get is your start menu back to the way that you used to like it when it was Windows 7. So let's take a look at how we can go ahead and install this. You've got a free trial which you can take a look at to see whether you like it or not before you uh, bite the bullet and spend your massive three dollars and 99 cents. You can see that it gets updated on a regular basis which is a good thing because some of the software out there doesn't get updated and that can be a security risk so it's always good to have um, updates on a regular basis. So let's go ahead and install this for everyone then go install very simple and easy to do it doesn't need administrative privileges to install this software which is a good thing now we can click on configure our start is back and this will give us access to the start is back configuration area so you can see here we're under the appearance area and this will allow us to change to the appearance that we want to use for our menu system you can change the buttons here as well to suit your needs you can also add your own in there if you wish um, but again I'm just going to leave this as simple as possible like the standard stock uh, image there and again I want to use this one here I like this one so we'll click on that one and then we'll choose our button which is the flag uh, icon there so we'll do these two now there's some other areas as well which you can change which is use custom start menu coloring and this will allow you to change the coloring of your start menu to whatever color scheme you want so just put the tick in there and again you've got the little slider for the for the gradient or the transparency and you can choose uh, the color picker to choose what color you want for your menu you can also use the custom taskbar coloring as well which means you can match uh, the actual menu system as well so you can get those matched you can also display all programs as a flyout menu just like it used to in windows xp style so if you want to enable that feature you just put the tick in there and it will enable that feature i'm going to leave that off you can hide user accounts picture as well if you want to now customize uh, taskbar perks you can see there's a, a few inside there and you've also got the icon size and the margins so you just change that click OK and away we go and there you should have your menu system when you click on it just like this one it looks absolutely awesome and it's really easy to use you've got your search box there you've got your programs here as well I don't know about you but I think this looks a lot better than the Windows 10 um, menu myself again you've got access to control panel and all your other little bits and pieces that you like to use there you can still right click and use the Windows 10 uh, menu system here so that doesn't go away but it just gives you a lot more access here and uh, I think it's a lot more better in my personal opinion now if you want to make this a little bit taller you can drag this up or you can change it in the config menu if you want to uh, access the menu again all you need to do here is right click on this little blank area here and you can then choose properties and this will allow you to get into the start is back uh, configuration uh, menu you can make changes here it's very simple and easy to do and very basic but basically that is it in a nutshell anyway that's basically how you can bring back the classic menu in windows 10 pretty basic video and i've done a couple of those this week uh, but they have been requested videos so Hopefully we can get back to normality uh, next week. Anyway, thanks again for watching, guys. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Have a great weekend. Bye for now. Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the red subscribe button and hit the bell notification button and click all to be notified when we upload new videos.